Alrighty, friendos, welcome in. Today's video, we are checking out this week's weekly challenge. So without further ado, let's tippy tap on over to detectives only. Put your detective skills to the test. This ghost is giving nothing away. Go go find the ghost type and 42 Edgefield Road. Ooh, so sounded like no evidence. Hmm. But the map I'm not a huge fan of because Edgefield is a pain in the butt for looping. Like I hate looping on the couch, but let's see what we got going on okay so no setup timer i think we're normal speed or maybe we have sprint for like a little bit longer uh we can see the breaker on the map it's in the basement this time 100 percent sanity looks like we have every piece of equipment but i don't even know if i'm gonna look for evidence because i mean the description sounds like there's no evidence so I'm gonna grab the usual zero. Si well, I have sanity, so. Ooh, okay, I have sanity. Mm, you know what? We're, I think we're just gonna send it. Let's see if we even have a cursed item, though. Okay. Breaker is off when you go inside, so. Oh, imagine we have the monkey paw right now. That'd be so cool. Okay. That'd be such a good ghost to try to do all these tests. Oh, I hear throwing things? I think it's in the basement. I think that's where I just heard throwing things. Um, okay, so cursed items. Not music box. If we even have one. Not tarot cards. Not near. Careful not to pop the breaker here. Um, oh, we have a Ouija board. Okay. Okay. Not ideal. Oh yeah, the ghost is definitely down here. Okay. Let's see if we have a summoning circle. I'll take a summoning circle. Okay. Why do we have a Ouija board, man? And let me just check for like voodoo doll and monkey paw before we just, yeah, no monkey paw. No voodoo doll. All right, looks like, I wonder if it's like a static curse item or if we get a different one every game. We'll have to see. So I'm just gonna set up to get a visual on this ghost. Let me just make sure I have hiding in the garage. I mean, the only thing that's gonna be a little... Oh, do we have no... Do we have no hiding? Help. Okay, we could use this hiding. This hiding's kind of scuffed, but we'll see if we can make it work. I almost want to see if this ghost is an early hunter, though. That could be helpful before I actually get it to hunt. Mm, no, let's screw it. <laughs> We're just gonna send it. We're gonna send it. I may regret this, but... Let's see, how much... Does asking the ghost its favorite room... How much does it lower your sanity? I can't remember. Because we could ask like a question that gets our sanity down to like 60% and then see if it hunts. What is our sanity at now? 90. Okay, let's ask it a couple of questions. How did you die? Um, oh god, not murder. Oh, that's so sad. <laughs> Goodbye. Okay, thank god the board listens to me. How much does it lower our sanity? Oh, we got some activity. Which, uh, that's probably just... Ouija, but that looks like EMF 5. But it could just be boards. Okay, so we're down to 80%. How old are you? Four. Four 44. We may never know. Goodbye. So I'm doing this like slow and steady. I can't, I think, I think it's what lowers it like 10% each question. I think so. I think we're at 10%. Okay, so like one more question. And we should be close to like most of the early hunters' thresholds. Um, what should I ask you? Do you like green eggs and ham? Do you have a biscuit? Goodbye. It's okay. That is okay. Um, okay, so oh yeah, our sanity's I mean, our sanity's close to like hunting threshold for all ghosts. So let's see here for like a minute or two and see if it hunts. And we could probably cross off the early hunters. If we're sitting in the light, we should be fine. As far as it, because like most ghost hunting thresholds is 50%. So if we stand here, it shouldn't, like our sanity shouldn't be dropping. All right, I'll start a timer. I'll give it like 60 seconds to hunt me. And if it doesn't, oh, my timer isn't up yet. I, was, <laughs> I hit my hotkey to start my timer. It's not loaded yet. Can we give it 60 seconds to hunt? If it doesn't, then we're going to cross off all the early hunters. Because I did leave the lights down in the basement. So if it is a mare, it could hunt. And I got to remember to go to the laundry room instead of the garage because there's no hiding in the garage 
<laughs> I'm so used to they're almost always being hiding in the garage. Oh, they just make it a mess down there. I wonder if it's gonna be a pulty. Okay, so while it's waiting, I'm going to throw. Some... Oh, I might have just stopped from standing there. I'm gonna throw some... Cause it's throwing a lot down there. So I'm already thinking like maybe pulty. But I've also had onis I like to throw a lot too. So we'll just do like a couple things here to see. But yeah, I don't think it's an early hunter. So we could probably cross off. Let me see. Start with a, few, a few things should tell us. We don't need like a whole heck and pile. Um, so we should be able to cross off Mare, Demon, Onryo, and Thay, because these all would hunt at um at, at least 60%. Okay. So let's go ahead and Oh. Okay. Well, maybe I seen any somehow dropped. Let's see. Normal speed. You're a phantom? You were like not following me at all though. Oh, that was, those hunts are short. You were not following me. I did not feel like, <laughs> Wait. How's my sanity so low? Could it be like a Mimo? Okay, we're gonna wait another hunt. Well, I'm kind of nervous because it is a phantom, it can wander up here. Because if it's a phantom, why isn't it been up here like... Yeah, it's still in the basement, what? Yeah, it's still a phantom. I'm going to smudge him so at least I have some time to go down and check for orbs. Okay, yeah, the hunts are like kind of short. I feel like, okay. Oh, he was busy down here. And he's offensive because he's a very long blink. Like, you see how invisible he was there for a little bit while he was chasing us? Yeah, there's no orbs. Oh, it's the only- I'm assuming we have no evidence. <laughs> I guess I could look for evidence. Um, uh, if we do have no evidence, Mimic would be the only ghost with evidence, which would be orbs. Okay, well, I don't see any orbs unless they're super sneaky. I just don't know why our sanity is so low. And I don't think I was in the dark that much. Okay, well, we're locking Phantom. Let's see. Oh, did I press it? There we go. It was indeed a phantom. Okay. So I literally had to Google this because I'm not used to playing with sanity and like phantoms draining my sanity. But I guess if you like look at the phantom, I'm looking at the Phasmo Discord. It like drains your sanity. So I guess we were looking at it. <laughs> you guys can tell me in the comments. Sometimes like when it comes to sanity, sometimes I'm a noob because I'm so used to not playing with sanity. So I'm not used to like seeing the sanity, certain sanity draining stuff. But that was, yeah, that dropped my sanity by like what, 20%? Okay. Let's go again. Um, I think we'll do the same thing. We'll try to see if we have an early hunter. And then um, we'll go from there. I was looking to see where the breaker is. Yes, breaker's in the garage. Okay. <laughs> it's nice to actually be able to like, be like, okay, breaker's here. Oh my god. Sunrise weather. Mm, we do have hiding in the garage this time. Nice. Oh, I didn't actually turn the breaker on. Okay. Let's see, do we have a Ouija board again? We do. Okay. Um, we're just going to go in the living room. Start talking to it. I think we can ask it like three to four questions. I think it's dropping our standing by like 10%. Okay, how did you die? <clears throat> how did you die? Sometimes when I tap out of the game, my game doesn't hear me anymore. How did you die? There we go. A. Accident. Oh lord. How old are you? 76. Okay. Do you like green eggs and ham? Do you like green eggs and ham? Okay. Duly noted. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay. I say no, not again. Okay. Well, let's just see what our sanity is at now. Yeah, activity is going off the charts. Okay, perfect. Uh, mm, we might need to be a little bit lower. Maybe we'll try to sit in the dark for a second. Okay, I see you sit in the dark for just a couple more seconds. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, well not a gin. I just turned off the breaker while I was trying to drop my sanity, okay. 
All right, well, I imagine our CNA is probably low enough for all the early hunters. Let me see. Assuming that it's not a mare in one of these rooms. It could be. Because I see it yet. Okay. Yeah, right about 6%. All right, so if it is an early hunter, it will hunt. Unless, yeah, unless it's a mare. Although I think I've been hearing it throw things upstairs or in the basement. So, all right, we'll give it a, like a minute to see if it hunts or not, and then we'll go from there. No, I could just be asking the Ouija board to play hide and seek. And we could it could just be like a super obvious ghost. But it's kind of nice to like roll off um like a mare in this situation, because mare is like one of the tough ones to, to figure out with no evidence. I guess it could be a mare and I have the light on in its room, which then it wouldn't hunt till 40%, but we'll see. Okay. Well it's been about a minute. It hasn't hunted, so I'm gonna assume not a mare. I guess we'll see when I play hide and seek and see what room it comes from. Let me just double check. Yeah. Why is our sanity draining so much? I don't. Well, I'm like in the light. Our sanity dropped like a solid like five, ten percent. I've been sitting in the light. I don't. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Hide and seek. Okay. Just gotta hope it's not in here. I think I hear it throwing things. Yeah, upstairs or downstairs. Mm hmm. Twins, maybe? Oh, Hantu. Okay. It was like fast upstairs as well as like the twins. Okay, so Hantu, the reason it was faster upstairs, hope I got stuck on the chair, is because it was colder up there or near its ghost room. And now that it's down here in the living room, far away from its ghost room, it's gonna be um, slower. And also, you see how it's not increasing with line of sight. Hantu's fast and cold temps. Hope you double back on me. Slow and warm temps and do not speed up with line of sight. And if I were to turn the breaker off right now, we could see her breath in this room, but she'll also probably get faster because, oh Lord, uh, she'd get faster because it would be colder in the house with the breaker off. Okay, well, easy peasy. <laughs> now I feel kind of silly waiting for my sanity to drain, but at the same time, like it's kind of good knowing it's not a mare. Welcome back. I've prepared some jobs for you. My next game, I'll go and go turbo mode. We'll just go ahead and I mean, I kind of want my sanity to be low enough so that... Oh, I, can I auto default to Sunny Meadows? I've always played in Sunny Meadows. I kind of want my sanity to be low enough to the, so that when I smudge, I know when it hunts, like, it, it'll be able to hunt. So maybe I'll ask it a few questions on the Ouija board. Because I think if you ask the ghost where its room is, it drops your sanity by a bunch, right? So maybe we just try that question instead. Oh, okay. Where well, we already have a sing-songer. Give me the people and free my soul. Wanna get lost in your rock and roll and drift away. Mm. Give me. Okay. This is over. So <laughs> I know we're all thinking you're ready. Banshee? Um, but we'll have to do more tests. We'll have to see. But it is a sing songer, though. We know that. Oh, okay. Not an Oni as well. There goes that air ball. Okay. See you later. Good, good day. Oh, it came it came back. I may have to even lower my sanity. Let's see, because I got hit by that ghost event. I've been in the dark a little bit. What's our sanity at? Sanity's at 80%. Okay. Now I don't know if I want to ask the ghost about its room, because I'll drop my sanity too much. Maybe I'll just ask it, like, how old... Oh, I should probably turn this thing on. How old are you? Oh, wait, we're just going to go turbo mode. I, I need to make sure my sanity's low enough. It said something nine. How did you die? F. E. L. Oh, you fell. Oh, Lord. Goodbye. Not my breaker. Bro. Not a gin. Not an Oni. Duly noted. Let's see what I say on side. My sanity's still high, so I don't really want to hide and seek until I know my sanity's low enough for it to haunt again after the first one. So let's ask us some more questions. Do you like green eggs and ham? Oh, okay. So the ghost is definitely on this floor. Or it's like a teleporter. Just threw that ball over there. They like green eggs and ham. Let's go. Do you like me? Let's go. Goodbye. Oh. It's a poltergeist. <laughs> it just absolutely exploded this dining room. No way. 
Oh, unless it's a Mimo. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure I'm Pulti, but we'll, we'll do a couple things. We will make a... No, you're gonna break this light. Please don't. I was gonna do Pulti things in here. You make my life hard, those you really do. Okay, let's set up some candles, which I'd do anyways. Okay. Um yeah, let me set up a little pulti file in here. We'll play hide and seek and I'll say like it just haunts on its own. Although I think it's been throwing everything I'm setting here off the couch, so. Oh, another air ball. Oh yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna haunt soon. It's been hitting me with air balls. I don't have that many things on the couch. I don't know how we're gonna be able to see with the light off, but. I think that'll be enough things. Okay, let's go for it. Hide and seek. comes. Oh. 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 He throw, he throws. Oh yeah. Room is a disaster now. Oh, dude, I hate when they follow me. I hate when they follow me after I smudge. Like, okay, so Edgefield's just awful because the couch is like such a long uh, loop that you can really only get like a couple loops out of them. You can't crouch loop there. And the nearest hiding spot is like a mile away. <laughs> but very clearly a pulti. But I thought I would go and loop it while it's hunting so you guys could see what a pulti looks like. I mean, we'll go back in here. Yeah, this couch is absolutely like there's a shoe on the TV. Hello? All right, well. We've done did it. Let's get our money. Ta da! Wow. <laughs> I feel like that was like much easier than the ones with evidence. Cause I'm just, you know. Well, we also got super easy ghosts that we could tell from their hunting behaviors, right? Like, if you get like a Mary Gorio or a ghost that doesn't want to do its ability, it's super annoying. But I do have um, some guides on how to figure out their ghosts just based off their ability with no evidence. I can link those down below if you're finding this challenge difficult. And as always, feel free to ask any questions down below. But that is all I have for you guys today. Hope you did enjoy. If you did, make sure to drop the video a like. If you love to drop me a sub, good luck ghost hunting, and I will see you in the next one.